Beautiful people, welcome to my channel. Welcome to Herbs and Mystics. Um, today I'll be talking about a few things you need to know about spells. Okay, just like I'm holding, this is a candle, and we use candle for various work spells. Okay, there are different colors of candles, and they are used for different kind of spells. Most spiritual candles that do candle work uses four major, major types of candles. Okay, now if you want to watch more of this, please subscribe to this channel before I go ahead into what we're discussing today. Subscribe to the channel, like my video, share my video, and also turn on your notification bell to be notified whenever I upload a new video. <laughs> To what we're discussing, like I said, most spiritual, most spiritually, sorry, that do candle work uses four major types of candle, which are the white, like this one, and molding, red color candles, green candles, and black candles. There, they also use other candles too, but these four candles are the major types. That I used mostly. Okay, we have a lot of color, a lot of candles in various colors, but the major colors that they use are those four that are listed, which is the white, the black, the red, and the green. Okay, now the white candle is used for cleansing rituals, it's used for purification rituals, it's used for peace invitation rituals, and so many rituals like that. Okay, while the red candle is used for love spells, romance, passion, and everything that has to do with relationships. All right, then the green color candle is used for money spells, for wealth spells, for affluence and abundance. Okay, while the black candle is used for back to sender spells separation spells cause breaker cells and so many others all right so now white candle can be used as a substitute for any of those spells okay in in place white candle can be used in place of a, a, a black candle spell in, in place of a red candle spell in place of a green candle spell okay what i mean is if you want to do any of the spells or any other spells and you don't have the or colors of the candles at hand you can use a white candle in place of it okay but it's also advisable to use the appropriate candle for quick and maximum effect now candle works are very very powerful the moment you lead a candle the spirit that works with the candle will arise and if you can't control it it will overwhelm you all right now before you cast on the spell you need to clean your workspace that's your altar that you'll be using you need to dress your altar you need to dress your candle i will take teach you how to dress your candle in another video very soon okay just stick to this channel so like i was saying before you cast in the spell I'm so sorry about that my camera went off okay so like i was saying before you cast in the spell you need to clean your space okay you need to clean you need to have a halter that you're going to do your spells your your work and so you need to clean that space you need to dress your candle in case of any impurities okay one of the main reasons why candle spells don't work is because your altar or your space is contaminated and the candle is contaminated okay so you need to clean your space you need to clean your altar for you to do your candle work and for you to get a good result and a good maximum benefit okay also, you know, the candle spells do not choke or tamper with the black candle. Remember, I said it's for cross breaking. It's for, it's for cross breaking. So you need to be careful 
and use it you need to be careful you, you need to know how to use it the right way okay but I'll in, in one of my videos I'll try to make a video on how to use your candles and how to dress your candles okay but that will be in another video so you need to stick right to this channel so you can get maximum benefit of what I'm gonna be teaching you guys okay so you have to be careful with using your red candle okay so before you like another tip is before you light any candle you need to be clean from any negativity or evil intentions that is you need to cleanse yourself you need to cleanse yourself okay so I'll be making a video also on how to cleanse yourself in this video all right I'll make that video after this one so you need to cleanse yourself before you do any candle work okay so guys that's all we're gonna be teaching for today about the four types of candles that we have we, we, we use majorly okay so to watch more of these exciting videos don't forget to subscribe to this channel and like this channel drop a comment down below to share your views and also to share whatever you you feel it's if it's, if it's contrary to what I say or if you think it works for you drop your comments down below thank you guys once again for watching this stay blessed